E-Series is one of the, our most popular product lines among our customers. It's compact and stylish. It's quite light and very easy to carry. The prop part number of E-Series verify from 2 to 3 with different models. E3 can provide as many as 3 parts. It provides practical and virus I.O. parts. It's easy to open by sliding the locking switch to the right. The monitor angle is adjustable to fit the watching angle. Press the patient button and enter a new patient information page. Input the basic patient information. The patient ID could be created automatically or manually. Then choose the application and fill in relevant information for exams. Also, we could choose patient directly from the patient list or work list to start the exam. After the patient information collection, we could begin the exam by the first step, choosing an exam mode. Here is the exam mode display. We could choose thyroid for example. It entered the BMO live scanning image area display in the middle of the monitor and parameter adjustment list below. We could switch the button to adjust or press the button to change the adjustment item and press next to go to the second page of parameters. Now I will introduce frequently used parameters of BMO include gain, increase or decrease brightness of image. Frequency Higher frequency for higher resolution, lower frequency for better penetration. Mu scan, sparkle reduction and age enhancement. Gray map, different levels of grayscale brightness. Dynamic range, higher dynamic for details, lower dynamic for higher contrast. Chroma, colorized image. And other frequently used parameter button such as depth, Focus, zoom, also available on the control panel to let you have an easy adjustment. Here we have three ways to zoom your image. Switch the zoom button for read zoom, press the zoom button for write zoom, or press Z for screen zoom. After you get a standard sector with good parameters to fit your need, press freeze to get the purest scene. Move your checkboard to choose your perfect frame and also there are relevant parameters displayed below. You can still make some adjustment after freeze. After finish the BMO scanning, you can press CFM button above the central control area to change to color mode scanning. You can also active SR flow by key function to improve the capability of detecting flow signal, especially low velocity. When you enter the live color scanning, the ROI box will appear in the center of the image area. You could move the checkboard to change the position and press set besides the checkboard to motivate size adjustment of the ROI. When the ROI box turns to imaginary line, move the checkboard to adjust the size and press set again to confirm the size. Parameters for color mode are displayed as well. Same way to switch the button to modify. Press PW button to enter PW mode. PW are available on B or color mode. The sample volume appear in the center of the image. Move your checkboard to move to the right position. Then press set to motivate size adjustment for the sample volume. And move the checkboard again to adjust the volume size. Press set again after finish volume adjustment, then update to active PW scanning. You could still move your checkboard to make a little change of position of the sample volume. PW scanning will follow the changes. But if you still want to modify the size of the sample volume, press update again to back to proactive. Besides the parameters list displayed below, we could still use the baseline scale button to help you modify the image. Don't forget to freeze after you get the PW image you want. If you want to modify your image more easily, just press auto to help you automatically optimize the B 
color, and PW mode. It saves your time for the comprehensive parameter adjustment. Besides examination above, E-Series also equipped with practical functions for your efficiency, such as SonoHelp, which could provide you guidance of exam. Other value function buttons are also displayed on the keyboard to help your daily work. After you get a frame of image you want, you could add your comment by pressing the annotation button to active annotation input or select from the annotation library. You can also select the right application to fit your needs. Press the body mark button and choose the right one. Switch the body mark button to change the angle of transducer marker and move the checkboard to put the transducer marker to the right place. Here comes to the caliper and calculation part. If you choose caliper to do some basic measure, the list will appear to left hand side. Click the measure you need. The mark will appear in the image area. Set the point and follow next step by step. The result will appear when you finish whole step. If you want to go to further measurement, press calculation button. More comprehensive measure list will display. You could choose different application. We cover abdominal, urology, small part, gynecology, obstetric, vascular, cardiac, and pediatric to face different professional examinations. All this calculation result will go to report automatically when you finish the calculation. After you get a perfect frame and scene, or you finish all the annotation, body mark, and calculation work, you can press Cine or Image button directly. The image and Cine will be saved in Calibur. You could use pointer to choose image to review and manage them by click this function item. When you finish all exam scanning, press report to review calculation result. Give comment by summary. Choose image to attach in the report. Preview your report if you finish all workload above. Then send them by DICOM or an exam if you only want to save them locally. By pressing the setup button in the lower left corner of the keyboard, you will go into the setting interface. There are different buttons on left side of the interface to show you how many items you can set up. Firstly, is about the general settings. There are four pages in the item including General, Display, Save, and Biopsy. On General page, it's all about the general settings including hospital names, language, time, etc. On Display page, you can change the display things according to the customer's preference. The save page is more commonly used because on this page you can change the storage time and also the key function of P1, P2, F3, F4, and Cine can be changed in this page. The biopsy things including biopsy guideline and biopsy grade lies on the page of biopsy. Secondly, let's go to the exam preset item. You need to choose the prop you want to change the preset. The presets shown on the prop interface are lying on the selected item column. They can be rearranged by the arrows and the buttons on the bottom right. You can also add the exam's presets into the selected items. There are two pages under the common items, Tools and Lists. On the tools page, you can customize the annotation elements. On the list page, the commonly used comments in different applications are listed. You can also add your own ones to the list. The body mark item is similar to the common item. It lists the available body marks in different applications, and you choose those ones you need. There are three pages under Measure Item. 
on the general page is all about the universal settings of measurements elements. You can also change the result position. On the application page, you can make the specific changes in different applications. For example, in OB application, you can choose different estimation for EFW calculation. On the list page, the core are menus of the calipers and calculation under different application are adjustable. Adding measurement is also available on this page. Under report item, the elements on the report are adjustable. Hospital logo importing is available, but the format and the resolution should strictly follow the instruction. All the adjustments made in this page will be shown directly on the report. There are two pages in peripheral item. Basic page is for the setting of video output, printer, and foot switch. Network page is for the internet connection. DICOM settings including surveys and local settings are lying on DICOM item. You can add, edit, delete, ping, and verify DICOM service on DICOM service page. Local device and storage settings are on the local setting page. The user menu is available in help item. You can load the default setting on the load page of load default item. Present settings can be saved as a given name on new page. Import and exporting settings are also available. Users management is available in user security item to make sure that the system is not used by the unidentified users. The About item shows the system information, which is quite important for troubleshooting. After making any changes, pressing the Apply button is necessary to make the settings to take effect. Press the Power button, the shutdown window will appear on the screen. Choose Standby, it will go to Standby mode and it will boot up in several seconds next time you press the Power button to turn it on. Choose shut down. It will shut down immediately. Cancel is used to cancel the shutdown procedure.